Halifax station was built at Shore Psych, approximately 220 yards west of the current location, and opened on the 1st of July 1844 by the Manchester and Leeds Railway as their terminus of a branch for their main line from Manchester to Normanton. With the opening of the line between Halifax and Bradford on the 7th of August 1850, a new station was opened on the current site. This had temporary wooden buildings. The station at Shore Psych was then extended and used as a goods depot. The permanent buildings at the current site were designed by Thomas Butterworth and opened on the 23rd of June 1855. This Grade 2 listed building housed the nursery associated with the Eureka Children's Museum until its closure on the 18th of December 2020. A new line was was constructed by the Great Northern Railway in the mid-1870s from the main station over a long viaduct to a station at North Bridge, then across and indeed partly in tunnel beneath the hilly terrain north of the town to an unusual triangular station at Queensbury, where the line divided into tracks for Keithley, Skipton, Carlisle and Morecambe, to the northwest and Bradford in the east. Halifax was redesigned during 1884 and 1885 and completely rebuilt during 1885 and 1886. Part of the new station opened on the 25th of October 1885 and the remainder on the 30th of May 1886. The new station had separate accommodation for LYR and GNR trains, the latter being on the west side. To distinguish it from Halifax St Paul's and Halifax North Bridge stations, the main station was known from the June of 1890 as Halifax Old Station and on the 30th of September 1951 was changed again to Halifax Town and on the 12th of June 1961 reverted back to Halifax. The Halifax High Level Railway was a related branch opened in the 1890s leading to Holmfield near Ovenden on the line to Queensbury through a half mile tunnel through a ridge and across the Wheatley Valley on a 10 arch viaduct past Samuel Bruce Webster's Brewery to Pelham, where there was sizable goods facilities, and then to St Paul's Railway Station in Queen's Road. This branch gradually fell into disuse, losing its regular passenger service as early as 1917. The last goods train ran in 1960, and the line was then dismantled, leaving the viaduct standing as a reminder of the former freight link. The Queensbury branch as a whole was closed in stages from 1955 onwards, although many of its engineering features remain. The route has lately been adopted and to an extent brought back into public use as an attention by Sustrans as a walking and cycle route. The principal structure on the line, Queensbury Tunnel, was at its opening the longest on the GNR system at 2,501 yards. It's currently deler deler derelict, partly flooded and impassable although a campaign is underway to save it for the inclusion of the Sustrans route. A campaign run by the local newspaper, the Halifax Even Courier, was started to get the station refurbished. The paper said that it wanted a station fit for the 21st century and the current state was disgraceful. Due to the amount of support generated, Network Rail and Northern agreed to do so. Work on this began on the May of 2009 on a £2.5 million pound refurbishment scheme that has seen the station footbridge and canopies repaired, new glazing and lighting system installed and the repainting of the structures. The second phase of the refurbishment covered the platform and the concourse and was completed in November 2010. In October 2014, plans were submitted to bring an old platform back into used to create three platforms together with signal improvements. Network Rail subsequently announced plans to upgrade the eastern portion of the Calder Valley line in 2017, which will see the surviving signal box here closed. Control of the upgraded track and new signaling was passed to York Railway Operating Centre in October of 2018. So to get us started here at Halifax, we see the departure of 195017 and 195010 working the 11.05 Northern service from Chester through to Leeds.
Up next to depart will be 158758, working the 1117 Northern Service through to Hull. Up next to arrive will be 195103, working the 11616 Northern Service from Leeds through to Chester. Round in the corner next for Northern will be 195116. Working the 11.30 Northern Service from York through to Blackpool North. Up next to depart for Northern will be 195.113. Working the 11.37 Northern Service from Manchester Victoria through to Leeds. Round in the corner out of the tunnel will be 195103, working the 1145 Northern Service from Leeds through to Manchester, Victoria. Next round in the corner into the station will be 15205, working the 1151 Northern Service from Bradford Interchange through to Huddersfield. Whilst appearing in the opposite direction will be 15201, working the 1158 Northern Service from Hull from Huddersfield through to Bradford Interchange. Arriving to terminate with a northern service from Hull, we see 158870. <laughs> Departing next some nine minutes late is 195118, working the 1154 northern service from Blackpool North through to York. Final train of this session is 195107, working the 1205 Northern Service from Chester through to Leeds. Thank you so much for watching everyone. If you enjoyed what you saw, click on the two videos here at the end screen. It helps out the channel. Also don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you uh, are new and got this far. And we'll see you all in the next video folks, wherever that may take us. We'll see you then folks.